Hey guys, before we get into the video, um, I just want to apologize for yesterday. We didn't really get good footage and we're having app issues, so we, we kind of ended a little bit early. Tonight we did a little better. Before we get into the video, I want to make this guy famous right here. Check out this comment. He's trolling me on every one of my videos. I appreciate the hate. The hate fuels me a little bit. I have this thing about proving people wrong. And so whoever this clown is, let's make him famous because He's driving me to make better videos and better content for you guys. With that, let's get right into it. Finally leaving the house. It's 6.07. I had some serious trouble with the app. Get like This is only my third request I've had in an hour, but I finally decided I'm gonna take one and leave the house. Things have gotten real serious around here. You're required to have a mouth covering when you go into any restaurant, whether you're an employee or a customer. Even though I'm not buying anything, I have to go in the store like this in order to get food, this started last night, and it is a pain in the butt. I'm not going to buy a mask, I'm just not gonna do it. I'm using one of my long sleeve shirts, and that way I can just pull it up and down as I go in. I just have it tied around my head. That's the best they're gonna get out of me, all right? If I infect the whole world by my mouth breathing, which is not gonna be the case, then this is all I can do to So there's the $3.50 override tonight. You would think that would make the orders like 10 bucks or whatever, but I don't know what they're charging the consumer, but this one is $7 with a $3.50 bonus. I can only do so much. I can only do so much. It smells amazing though, gosh dang. So I finished one, I made seven bucks, it's now 627. So what I say, I left it 608. Didn't get a second dash. I don't have one right now. I should, if it's 350 base pay, that means it's supposed to be really busy, right? Well, it's not. Okay, we're back in the game. Got one at Wingstop for 12 bucks. That means they are super stoked to get this food. I'm super stoked to get a second dash. Period. I will be there in five minutes. I've been out 39 minutes and even though I've only gotten two requests, somehow we're still at uh, $19 right now. It's just right about $30 an hour. Here we go. We got another Wingstop one for $9.50. Let's get it. We just got to take what we can get. It said apartment A on the app, so I left it at apartment A. Just flying solo tonight. I wish it weren't that way. It's way more fun to have two phones but I've been out 56 minutes, I made $29. I really hope that this level of excellence can be maintained. The destination is on your left. Oh, no way. Yo, what? This is like a fat stack, what is this? One, two, three, five, woo! And five bucks on top. That's $14.50 for that order. It was just a simple uh, panda order. 14.50, gosh dang. Let's go, let's go. All right team, it is 8.05. I've been out an hour and 57 minutes. I've raked in $56, so I'm not hitting 30. Again, I'm by myself, which makes it oh so hard. We could be literally like pushing $40 an hour right now. I'm pumping out $28 an order by myself. So I'm hoping this keeps up that last hour was actually decent. So I gotta level with you. I'm not fully committed to this mask thing. As you can tell, I got just a hoodie wrapped around my neck. A month ago, they said masks did not help and they didn't want anyone buying them. Now they say everyone should wear a mask, but the CDC has already shown that the N95 and the surgical masks are the only ones that actually prevent the virus. Now, if I have the flu or something else, maybe my shirt would help, but it does not prevent the virus. So all these people making homemade masks, I don't want to discourage people from the illusion of safety, but I, I need someone to help me. I need you to help me, help me to feel that I'm doing the right thing because I, I don't. Can somebody drop a comment for me and tell me their thoughts on the homemade mask situation and how they feel about it? I gotta say, all these restaurants are on fire today. Like, every restaurant has been absolutely slaying it. Even Panda, man, even though I was outside of Panda for like 10 minutes, like, they still were, they were there was like six people in there 
literally just slaying it, just chopping it up, throwing it in the bag, chopping it up, throwing it in the bag. I will be there in three minutes. This is, I think, the biggest base pay I've ever taken. Obviously, I've made like almost $19 on an order before. This one alone uh, on the app was $13.47, which sets a new record for a pickup for me. Hey, leave me a comment and let me know the best that you've ever made on the app. I'm not talking about a $20 tip that you got when you got there, that you got paid in cash. What's the highest amount you ever received on the app from one delivery? Let me know in the comments. I feel like a hero anyways. I've made $77 in two and a half hours. So I'm like literally right on my pace. Just got a Wingstop order for $4. It's back. Here's what's happened. The extra pay is gone. We're stuck with whatever the app's gonna give me now. I think a lot of drivers are gonna go offline. I'm really hoping this is my time to shine and I'll get some double dashes because I haven't got a single one tonight. It's been one order at a time. And if you've watched my last few videos, I've been doing up to four orders at once with two phones. Right now I'm making $30 an hour on one phone, one order. Don't let them get you with these $3 orders. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, too small. Too small, my time is valuable. Man, I could not have been more right. It's been just over 10 minutes since I finished that other one. I've already declined five $3 orders. Literally all of them are $3. I do not know what they're charging the customer, but whatever they're charging the customer, it's discouraging them from tipping. It's what they're beating us with. But I don't really have a choice, do I? I gotta take some then. There's a chance I get a second one. There's always a chance I get a second one at Little Caesars. So even though it's only $4.50, and that is disgraceful, we're going to take it, because we need something. The only way I can make $30 an order is if I get $5 orders and deliver them within 10 minutes of receiving them. That's the only way. Any other way, this is essentially a waste of time, but I can't, I can only decline so many before I just, I'm, I just gotta be itching to go. I gotta do something. Well, them's the breaks. Finally, I was at that Little Caesars for two zero, 20 minutes waiting, not to mention driving there and driving to this one. So it's gonna be almost 30 minutes for $5. This is why I just gotta keep reminding myself to be freaking patient because I can't do this. I can't keep doing this for five bucks. You never know what's gonna happen. I did get a second one while I was waiting at that Little Caesars out in front. I can't wait for it. I mean, if it's gonna take 20 minutes, I gotta drive and deliver this one and then come back. It's literally worst thing that's ever happened to me dashing. So on the heels of waiting 20 minutes for the order, I had a second Little Caesars. That took forever. I went to drop it off. The guy wasn't answering the phone. I walked across the lawn, gigantic, gigantic pothole like you wouldn't believe it didn't even rain today thing was so deep got my whole left shoe muddy got water all the way up to my knee i had to go home and switch shoes socks and pants so i can go back out fortunately this next one was kind of on the way to my house and thank goodness because otherwise i would have had to call it a night i couldn't even put my left foot down in the car maybe that uh that means you should keep it in mind if you're not dashing near your house you better uh take change of shoes and socks just in case something like that happens to you whether it's dog poop or who knows what i will be there in five minutes fortunately Mr. Dash is looking out for me. He gave me two $9 orders at the same wing stop. Somehow they were both ready at the same time. That is pleasant. No drinks, which is impossible. Impossible with wing stop. And they were right next to each other. So we're back in the game. All right, we got a choice to make. We've, we're we not sitting on 120. We've been out exactly four hours, no. We've been out three hours and 55 minutes. If I drive home now, it'll be four hours. Pulled in $107. In four hours, that's not terrible. It's about 27 an hour. Pretty good for being by myself. I was kind of hoping to do better, but I mean, I can't really be that pissed. That was even with having that really crappy order at Little Caesars for, for $4.50. So there you have it. I made just over $106 at $6 in cash tips to go with uh, my earnings right here was doing so well until Little Caesars hosed me deeply. and But we still ended up $26.61 an hour tonight. I probably drove maybe 20 miles. So it was like $1.50 in gas. Easily over $25 an hour. It should have been $30 an hour. I'm so upset. Like I was fur literally furious. And I stepped in a puddle 
like up to my freaking knee. Like how is that even possible that is in your front yard? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I'm on a quest to make these sweet videos until the quarantine is over. I will go out nearly every night and then throw together a video real quick for you guys. Hope you're enjoying. If you do, again, give me a thumbs up. Go ahead and leave me a comment. If you appreciate these videos, I appreciate the support. I try to get to every comment. And as always, have a blessed day. God bless you. It is Easter tomorrow. Glory be to the King, the Most High, Jesus Christ. Have a great one.